Welcome back, guys. In this episode, I was going to do uh, I was, was going to do a farm and decorate it up, but I'm going to do something else instead. We'll do that in the next episode. I'm, in this episode, we're going to focus on the, the the awesomeness of the modular buildings because they are seriously, seriously staggering. Uh, before we get into that, I'm going to pause the game for a minute and I'm going to show you some stuff that uh, people have asked to see. You can go away. So uh, people were very interested in uh, the town growth. So let's have a quick recap then. So cash, we're making like over 5 million a year. So the cash is coming in very, very nicely. Thank you. Uh, let's have a look at the town growth. So the, here's the town statistics. And so let's see who's growing. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Gugget City is up 140%. Let's have a look. So we're getting 70% from uh, from public transport, 30% from uh, the uh, private transport, and then 60% from shipping in the fuel. Lovely. Uh, and then we're getting minus 20 because of some emissions. Now let's have a look at Honkelbrief City. Honkelbrief is uh, is down 30% because of emissions, which is uh, which is not great. I mean. <laughs> Not great. It's fine, <laughs> but I kind of want to make the point. So, uh, right. So we, let's have a look at Honkabrief City and its emissions. So, whoa, look, emissions really start to build up. So we want to do something about that. Um, I mean, to be honest, like, do, do we need to do something about it? No, not really. But I want to do something about it because because I want to make some cool stuff. So what are we going to do now? I had a, um, another oil uh, another oil well over here which I demolished. So I'm owed an oil well. In fact, I'm owed two oil wells and a coal mine. Let's um, let's do some stuff. I, I'm going to get rid of this um, this iron mine here because it's like because it's horrible. Right next to the town, no, it needs to be moved out somewhere. So we're going to get rid of that. That's going first. There we go, lovely. And then down here, this oil well, demolish. This oil well over here, demolish. We're going to set up. A really big oil terminal here and it's gonna be epic let's get rid of that get rid of that and that and that get rid of all this nonsense around here goodbye goodbye um, I'm also gonna get rid of this um, oil and fuel line well our, our crude line so let's have a look TF crude let's configure the vehicles uh, right we're gonna get rid of all of those sell Sell all vehicles? Yes. Goodbye. Bye bye. Thanks very much. And uh, if I go to the line manager and let's see, TF crew. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna um, I'm gonna keep that line. I'm gonna get rid of the stations, but I'm just gonna rename this to SF crude. Oh yeah. Right then we can get rid of this completely. They just love like ripping stuff out. <laughs> It's kind of, kind of a lot of fun, uh, and yeah, let's get let's get rid of this nasty bit of road. And you'll see that when you get rid of stuff, if you've just if you've just laid like track and it's deformed the the, the, the terrain, when you get rid of it, it restores it, which I really like that. So all of this goes back all the way to the oil refinery. Goodbye, goodbye, and it's gone. Hooray! There was much rejoicing. All right, cool. So, having ripped that out, what are we going to do? Well, we're going to send the oil around, the crude oil, by ship, and we're going to have a really awesome, um, like whole oil production thing. Shut up, Sky. Just build it. All right, all right, okay. So, uh, what do I want? First thing I want is um, is I'm going to put my I'm going to put my dock in for yeah. I'm going to put my dock in first. So let's go ship, dock, flip you around like that kind of thing. I think so. We'll put you in like that. Okay, this is our start. But that's kind of um, no. And I've put a, you know I've put a passenger in, haven't I? Yeah. Let's try putting a cargo dock in. Bonehead. Uh, so come on. Come on, there we go. There we go. 
But that looks fairly unimpressive, right? We want this to look much more impressive. So let's configure this. And what I'm going to do is I want to extend this dock out like quite significantly. So I think let's get, um, if I get a large dock, where do I, where do I want to put this? Really, I'd kind of like it. You know what? I'm going to put, I'm going to put a dock there and a dock there. I may change this. This may all change. This may all change. But I'm going to play around. But this is the the joy of just playing around with it. So if we have a couple of these, one on either side, uh, maybe maybe two on either side. What do you what do you think? Two on either side. Yeah, two on either side. Okay, cool. And then if I if I just get out so you can see. Um, I, I, this we want this to be a bit more like like I don't like that this doesn't go all the way to the end so let's make it go all the way to the end so you just go in here misc and you can grab this pedestrian ent ent this is a pedestrian entrance or a series of pedestrian entrances and then now you can get them to go in different directions so that's going you can see the bollards are going in this direction but if you move it to there, we can have this going all the way along here like that and make it all look nice and tidy at the front. Or at the, well, at the back, I suppose. That's really the back. And then um, I want these docks to extend out. So let's get uh, another of these large cargo docks. They're, they're pretty expensive, but... Now, like half a million each. So I'm going to put that one in there and that one in there. Now, your ships are going to dock where the anchor is, right? And obviously, we don't want our ships docking there. God, that looks, that looks not bad at all. Um, so what we do, go to landing and we'll put in... Now, I, I think really I want my ships to come in here. So I'm going to put in one there. And, well, you know what? I might even just put like four in, because <laughs> like, why not? Uh, and I definitely want to get rid of that one. Well, do I want to get rid of that one? Uh, you know what? It's fine. Just leave it. Don't, don't, me don't mess with it. It's fine. Okay, so now that is a dock. I mean, you compare that to the docks that we had in Transport Fever 1. Oh, my God. It's, it's just awesome. It's just awesome. And then we'll go over here. I'm going to put a nice road in. Let's grab our road. Uh, how big am I going to make this road? Um, let's, let's try with a slightly bigger road. So I want a road going across there. The problem is that the terrain's going to be a bit all over the place. And I want this to be nice and, nice and smooth. So let's go to terrain. Grab my flatten tool, and then from here, oh, you know what? Let's make my brush a little bit bigger. Strength one. Flatten that out there. Flatten that out there. And then, I'm actually gonna flatten this out. Let's crank my brush size up. I'm gonna flatten an area around here because we're putting in some oil wells okay should be good all right so oil wells let's go to industries and i want what do i want where's oil wells oil wells is here so i think oh now do i use do i use their road maybe i use their road I'm going to leave a little bit of space because I want to be able to upgrade that road. And I want this one to be... Actually, I probably want this one further over there. Okay, you know what? Let's let's put this one maybe... 
kind of there-ish. A little bit closer, there. Then I'm gonna flip this one around in this direction. Now I can't have them like directly linked up. So, hmm, let's see. I think maybe like that. And then I want another one on the other side. How am I gonna do this? Oh, you know what? Oh, 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 I kind of like that. Uh, let's take you back just a little bit so that the roads line up. Something like that. All right, let's get my road tool. A street tool and upgrade. I want to upgrade to these, really. Yep. You know what, I wonder, can I upgrade to that? No, I can't upgrade to the biggest road. That's a shame, but it's fine. So we'll upgrade that, because that, these are these are tarmac, right? But you see, look, I need to flatten out there. Let's get rid of you again. Get rid of this bit of road. And what do I want? I want my terrain tool, I want to flatten. Let's just take it out a bit more, like that. Get another oil well, uh, industry and oil well. Flip you around the way you were before. So about, about like, I, I mean, I'd like it really close. You know what? I want, yeah, we could probably do it. If I put that in like that. Yeah. And demolish, I, well, yeah, go on. Demolish that road. We'll do it like this. We'll take this road like straight up there like that. And then run it through there. Awesome. Awesome. Loving it. Now you can come across. You know what? Let's bring you straight along there. And have you hook it up like that. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah, and then I think, do I, do I wanna change the textures around here? I think I probably do. Let's have a look, paint tools, what do I want? I want things to be kind of a bit rough, especially in this middle bit over here. Um, let's maybe just have a bit of dirt going on around here. Now, I could, I could put some more asphalt in here so that these, um, these paths don't look so, because they kind of look a bit strange. So maybe, let's get this, and let's see, where's, where's a nice asphalt? Uh, that's gravel, asphalt. I'm not sure which one we're gonna need. I'm thinking, I don't know, maybe this one. Let's bring the brush size like right down. We'll keep the strength up though. So let's see, what, 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 what is this? That's too light. Ooh. Oh, that's nice. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's close. That's the one. So, just kind of fill that in. We'll leave, um, leave a bit of grass. Or, I, you know what, I might put a bit of grass in after that. So... Or I could just I could just make it dirt. But I don't know. Yeah, I, I'm really I'm really tempted to just switch it to dirt. Which is uh, where's my dirt? Let's let's see how. So can I can I texture over? No, I can't texture over the footpath. So no, we've got we've got to go with the asphalt. So what was it? Asphalt. Um, asphalt two was it? Oh, I can't, oh, I can't, it looks like I can't change it there. Oh, man. Okay, never mind, never mind. But let's, gra let's grab the grab the dirt again. Where's the dirt? And there, there will be some areas that we can kind of dirty up a little bit. So let's grab, let's change the strength down to like, say 30. And just make this like a little bit more scruffy and blend it in a little bit the scruffiness of the... Oh, I 
miles. And it'll make it look like less, like less rectangular and stuff. Uh, we want, uh, I'll do the terrain after. Man, you can have some fun with this, can't you? Oh, yeah. Just a little bit more around it. Outside down there. Can I do? Can I do? Oh, yeah, you can. See, this is this was way too bright in the center. But just darken it down a little bit. blends in and looks all nice and mucky. Loving it. Uh, how about a little bit of gravel? Take the strength down. See, I love this this kind of like light gravel. Just introduces like a really nice texture. And again, helps to blend it together. Oh, ho, ho, ho. all right, this is coming together quite nicely. And that side. And wherever I can get a little bit in. A bit over there. And a bit down there. Definitely a bit on this corner. Okay. Yep, kind of liking that. Definitely want a bit of gravel to because we've got this gravel here. We want to extend that gravel out a little bit. All the way around. Make it blend into the surrounding or surroundings. Uh, then let's grab uh, some bit of smoothing. Smooth that off around there. That's nice. Moving up into the hills. Blends in a bit better. Oh my goodness. It's not bad, is it? This here, it looks a bit strange. I think we should grab a road, just a small one. And maybe have uh, a road coming around here. I just, I'm going to step it across because I want to keep this texture here. So let's have a bit of a road that comes out. Say there, that, and then it can hook up to there. All right, cool. And we'll have this go around like that kind of thing. Yeah, that's fine. All right, a uh, little bit of smoothing just to make it look nice. No idea what I'm going to do with this road uh, over here. I might, I might have that going off over there. Um, this area, I think I'm going to do. I think I'm going to do a farming area here, but I haven't made a final decision on that. But let's see. How's it look? Not bad. I think we want um, a bit of tree cover around here. And, and uh, this I love. This I love. Let's go to um, go to the assets. Go to the end. Oh, well, pick the trees first. Go to the end. There's this. And it allows you to put in a random selection. Oh, God, it's good. Um, I just want kind of the main tree. So I don't want the banana plants. The banana plants are like little little bushy things. Um, I don't want the lemon trees or the peach trees because they're very like they're very small. Um, so palms. I think pretty much the rest we can go with. Um, yeah. So let's see what that looks like. So we'll set set our brush size like that. 
put in some. Hmm. Yeah, I don't. I don't really like this tree particularly. So I think we'll take that out. Uh, which is, I think, I think that's the Korean Stuartia, which is uh, this one. Yeah, this one. See. Uh, yeah, not so keen on those. Let's get my erase tool. Erase those. Okay, so you know, well, yeah, go back to my mixture and let's say strength. We'll take the strength down and maybe take the brush size. Yeah, no, that's fine. So I want. Let's see how this looks. Yeah. Looks okay. Oh, I didn't take those out. Let's take those out. Get rid of those. And go back to those. So, how's it look now? I think we want the strength up a little bit. Yeah, those are the trees that I want. All right. Oh, I, I love this new tree brush. It's kind of awesome. Uh, I want this coming down like close to the edge of the beach. And I like that. Let's take you up a touch. Yeah, let's fill in a bit. I don't want it quite so. Like, I don't want it this dense down by the beach. And. You know what? I was gonna, I was going to remove that, but I kind of like that tree there. Let's have a few kind of closer onto the edge of the beach. Just a few palms, and if they're too close together, just thin them out. Uh, don't want that on the beach. So that I would say looks pretty nice. Well, we're going to do something which I think is at least as good, maybe better, over here, because we're gonna ship the oil from these uh, from these oil wells out here to an oil refinery, uh, and we're gonna build in the, the train station here into like a whole depot setup. It's gonna be kinda cool. So, what do I wanna do? I wanna get, um, let's see, what do I want? I want a harbor, and a cargo harbor, is going to be flipped around. Now I want to line this up with this. So that looks right. Yeah, I, it's uh, one more maybe? No, 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 that's right. Okay, so how do I want this? I want this about there, I think. So that's going to go in there. And then I, I kind of like to do something different. I mean, this looks really nice. But I want to do something that's kind of a little bit different. So let's do, let's do something different. What do I want? Um, let's get a couple of these little cargo docks pointing out like that and that. And then we'll grab a couple of these buildings. And Maybe do that and that. Let's get rid of that and put this dock back in without the anchor. And then I could put another one of these in there. And then maybe I'll just have some of these to just extend that back a little bit. Yeah. Like that. And then I'm going to want some of these uh, some of these passenger entrances. Uh, it's just a question of when. Oh, so I can't put them on there because of the water. So let's go. Let's go out of here. Let's grab my terrain. And I guess I want to flatten this up. So let's flatten this up across there. And across there and then I want to flatten this out up to here now it's not quite level with this but it's kind of close so 
I think we'll probably have the the nasty edge up against the edge of that. So that'll do, and then we'll we'll smooth it all out afterwards. All right, cool. So what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was putting in the pedestrian accesses, wasn't I? Yep. So what do I want? Uh, configure and pedestrian accesses. So what, like, what I was thinking of doing was having. Because you see, you see the bollards. What I was thinking was like have a, an access there, and then have the bollards going around like that. But I don't know what to do on this corner. Because what I really want is one without the bollards on, but I can't have that. So I think I'm going to have to do it like that. It's what it is. You know, just we just have to live with it. Now we'll do the same on this side. You know what? Do I, do I want the bollards there? Maybe I'll put the bollards there. All right, cool. And then uh, docks wise, what do I want docks wise? I think, what, what did I do over here? I had like two arranged like that. At least I want to do something maybe a little bit different. Maybe we'll have like. Big dot coming out that way. And extend that out there. Like that kind of thing. And I'm just wondering whether I want to extend these docks across because like they god they look impressive. Um Maybe maybe like that. Maybe like that's good enough. I'm t I am tempted to have one on the other side here. Yep, I'm going to have one there, so, which means I'm going to grab one of these uh, and just put it behind there, just extend it a little bit. Probably it should do the same on this side. And a couple on there just to kind of square that off there. Let's have a look at that. How does that look? Pretty impressive, I would say. Right, let's get on to the railway station bit because this is where it might get very cool. So what do I want? I want uh, a road uh, which is going to go across the front of here. So it's going to go... Uh, am I going to do it with a small... Yeah, I think I'm going to use a small road. I, I, you know, I'm kind of tempted almost to use some um, streets, but... Because I kind of like the asphalt look, but... I think we'll go with this for now. Gonna extend that out. Extend that out. Yep, that's fine. And then what I want is a road coming down the side here, but I want this coming out straight is the only thing. So if I just line that up with there, right, no, too close. So let's say there. All right, that looks fairly straight. And then I want you coming down here. But I want this part to be flat is the problem. So what I need to do is bring that down like that. Is that straight? I think that's straight. Straight-ish. And run that out. Yeah, it wasn't quite straight. But you know what? It's straight enough. It'll do. Trim off this end. Because I want this to look fairly regular, is the is the idea. I'm not sure what I'm not sure gonna I might I might tarmac those areas. Actually, you know what? Let's have a quick look. Let's have a look. I mean, we've got, we must have this this we've got this dark asphalt, haven't we? So, um, is it this one? Oh, I think that might be the one. Let's increase the strength of it. So, no, it's not that one. Is it this one? Yeah, it looks like that one, I think. So. Let's asphalt all of that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. The things you... You know what? Let's go... Um, with a sharp edge along there. You can... By the way, you can rotate the brush. Um, or I could have used the this one and done a, a sharp edge with that like that. Fill that in. 
Oh yeah. All right. It's going to get even better now with this uh, with this train station. Trust me. Trust me. It's going to look blooming awesome. Right. We want train station. We want buildings. We want. I'm going to take a, a terminus. Flip it around. Now I reckon I want it roughly there. This is the one thing. You have to guess how big the buildings are that you want to add in for spacing wise. And I wish it had a few more options, but I'm sure that the modders will uh, will solve that problem for us. So it might take me a couple of uh, couple of attempts to get the spacing right on this, but I reckon about. Let's try that. Let's try that. Okay. This. Oh, if I can get this right, this is going to look so damn good. Right, so I'm going to take off the um, take off the building on the end, and I'm going to put in one of these large buildings, which, as you can see, extends out. Let me show you. Extends out quite a ways. But you know what? That's, that's not particularly flat, is it? This road. Let's take this. Take this out. Let's try that again. So what do I want? I want a road running down here like that. That's better. Thank you. Then we can say so trim that off and have the road uh, go up like that. Yeah, much better. Then I can get uh, smooth. There we go. Awesome. Right, let's go back to configuring this because this, this is just the beginning. Oh, yeah. Right, so what I want, I want um, probably these medium buildings, like on this side. Uh, so I think we want to move things across a little bit. So how am I going to do this? I think we want uh, tracks. Let's get rid of these platforms like this and I'm probably going to go with like four platform uh, four four tracks in here um, you know what if I took that out put in a platform in the middle and then had another two tracks like that and that now let's see cargo buildings medium uh, oh I need a I'd need a platform there so if I have a platform there, I don't know whether I'm going to have enough room. No, I haven't got enough room. Okay, you know what? If I take out one of the tracks, that'll probably give me enough room. And cargo building goes. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Loving it. Okay, sweet. Right, what I'm going to do now is I, I want this to be like a, a complete complex of buildings. So I'm going to take you out and not passenger buildings, cargo buildings, please. I'm going to have a big building on this end and then probably something smaller in the middle. Um, maybe like that. Hmm. Oh, oh no, I, no, one of those. Yeah, we want one of those and then one of these on that end. So I need to extend the, this out a bit. So we'll have another platform go there. And then one of these big cargo buildings on this end like that. Awesome. Awesome. Now, oh my goodness, I can get one of those in there. Oh, ho, 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 ho. All right, let's have one of those there. Oh, uh, we want, you know what? I'm gonna put one of these, one of these small buildings in. Um, this one, just to, just to kind of space it out a little bit. Then we'll have one of these medium ones there. Right, let's extend the tracks and the platforms. So I've only got, I've only got three tracks in, but you know what? That's fine. I was gonna go with four, but three's fine. So let's extend these out. I'm only going to extend it out to about uh, there. So let's grab another platform, X 
extend that platform out like that. Boom, boom, boom. And platform down the middle. Looking nice. Right, now let's decorate this up with some buildings. So what do I want? I want um, another one of these mediums in there. And then one of these different ones that gets smaller. But I'm going to put a space in and put one of these little ones in. Like that. And what I want is for the, for the buildings to kind of get smaller as they come out. So I put another another spacer in and then I'm going to have one of these little ones and then spacer on the end. Oh, come on. That's not bad, is it? <laughs> I love it. All right. So then the other side, because it's because I want it to feel part of this complex over here. I want bigger buildings over here. So I'm really tempted to put another one of these in. To really, really make it look impressive. And then maybe... Uh, or do I, do I go with one of those? Oh, oh, the, 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 the choices, the choices. Let's get rid of that. I do, one thing I do wish, I wish that you could play around and configure it all. And then it charged you for it at the end. And not while you're doing it. Because every time you take put buildings in, take them out, you're losing the money, which I'm not so keen on. Maybe extend that out with a, one of these buildings and then have one of these there. Oh, yeah. Now, just imagine when the modders get hold of this and start producing all kinds of different buildings that you can put around here. It's going to be like incredible what you're going to be able to do. And it's um, it's kind of so simple that like anybody can do it, and anybody can do it like pretty quickly. And then this is all too bright and green and whatever, so let's dull that down around here. So I think a bit of forest like that. Maybe have a bit on the other side as well. Link you up to there. Oh, that's... Well, I'm going to say that that doesn't look too bad. Need to get some trees in here as well. Oh, restore it to its pristine natural beauty. And here it is all running. I've put uh, eight ships on this line. And obviously with three oil wells here, it, it's churning out the oil. Just like it was before, we've always got a supply of oil here. So these ships are running, uh, are running full. Are they bringing back any fuel? Yes, they are bringing back fuel. Awesome. I moved the truck stop. Well, actually, I didn't move it. I, I replaced it with uh, a truck stop here because uh, it needed to be closer to the harbour. And that's, uh, that's running this stuff in. I've actually put in some waypoints so that the truck stop. So the, the trucks are staying away from the residential area as much as possible. And we've got the emissions, and we've got the emissions down 10%. Awesome source. Cool. Should we have a quick look at the emissions? Let's have a quick look. Yeah, so we've got rid of the bad emissions that we had here. So that's good. And look, <laughs> yeah, now we've got the emissions out here. Awesome. And I've rerouted re this train line from uh, from the new station. And that's probably keeping some emissions away from uh, Gugget City, which is very, very good. And I put an extra couple of ships on the on the fuel line. And they're no longer waiting. They're just picking up whatever's there. Alrighty, so we have got a couple of, uh, a couple of I think, pretty stunning looking docks. We've got a, a whole oil production facility over here. We've got a, an awesome oil refinery over here. I love how that looks. That is just terrific. All right, guys, we will leave it there for this episode. Keep the, uh, keep the tips and suggestions coming in and the ideas. And uh, I will catch you for the next one. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Peace out.